Greetings, Klausowitz here. So, in this What Means video, I want to talk about tactic, what, is, uh, what it means, and so on. And I have to say already that I wouldn't propose another meaning for this word. The actual meaning is fine, but what is more important in here than with the other words is that actually most of the time the word isn't used right uh, in the right way or it's confused with strategy. And uh, mostly outside of military context people use it interchangeable, which is, I would say, fine. Because this is how language often works and you, we have like words we use for different meanings uh, or different meanings used for uh, have the same word and stuff like this. But um, if we go more in the military area and if we actually look at video games of movies or even people who are, want to talk about it, they often confuse those two terms. And so um, there's a special need of clarification what this actually means. So the first word is tactic and you heard this a lot I'm, uh, I, I'm sure. The thing is uh, the word tactic and strategy actually came from Karl von Clausewitz, which is the guy I actually stole the name from, and he was like the first big military uh, military theorist. Theorist, I hope I say it right. And um, so he he wrote a very very big uh, book about well, multiple books actually about war, and um, of we actually also teach this um, still at military academies and this is actually debatable if this is a good thing or not because also Clausewitz is outdated at many points. So the thing is tactic. The th he describes tactic as some, um, all what concerns the battle or a battle basically. And so what is connected to the soldier and um, or to the soldiers when you give them orders to the troops directly on the field of course. and. Um, so this is basically it. It's very simple to, gra uh, to grasp actually. It's all what concerns the battlefield and the troops. And this can actually um, be little things like how a specific um, squad has to behave or as, uh, how a specific kind, kind of unit has to fight or has to formate themself or how movement of troops is working and uh, working with each other. And also information and circumstances like the terrain, also weather and everything can be tactic. And um, of course when you have a tactical plan then this means what you do on the battlefield. What is your plan for the battlefield um, with your troops and everything. And so this is then tactics and it's pretty easy actually. Um, so I actually don't understand why it's so often confused. Like I said, outside of military stuff, I fully understand because it actually also means something like plan. And we then use it for like, oh, my tactic in here is I will build first the house and then the wall around it. Then this is fine. This is like what you want to do in which order, basically. And this is what tactic also describes. Like, I do this with my troops first and then the other thing. But like I said, tactics, but also a tactic can describe a specific action inside of like multiple tactics. If I just be on my battlefield, my army is fighting against the other army and I have like Hammer and Anvil is a good bad example. Hammer and Anvil is a tactic because it's like a composition of movement, of behavior, uh, with a goal and everything on the battlefield with what the troops would uh, do then also on the battlefield. And Hammer and Anvil for you, you don't know it, is like this Alexander the Great or even his father did it, this, this tactic that what, uh, one type of your troops or one a part of your army is like binding the enemy, holding him in place and then the cavalry, the companion cavalry in this case, comes around and smashed in the back. Basically, like I said, the companion is the hammer and the phalanx is the anvil and then to destroy um, the enemy formation. And so this is a tactic and this is like a f predefined tactic actually and this you can say, oh, which tactic we use here? Oh, we use um, hammer and anvil tactic or we use hit and run tactics. This is then what actually tactic means. Pretty easy actually, nothing very special. So I hope you enjoyed this video, give it a like if it's so, and please subscribe to my channel if you already did, and hopefully see you soon.